the Speaker of the House of Commons has vowed to keep buggering on amid more claims of bullying in his office. John Burko was accused of creating a climate of intimidation and fear among MPs and officials by former Black Rod David Leakey. Mr. Leakey, who stood down as Black Rod last year after seven years, said he saw the red mist descend over the speaker during a conversation about seating arrangements when a high-profile visitor was attending the Commons. Mr. Leakey told BBC's Newsnight. He just took complete exception to what was being proposed and discussed and the red mist descended and he banged the table and yelled and was highly insulting to me, personally, including calling me an anti-Semite, he's Jewish himself I think, for which he apologized afterwards. He said it had been water off a duck's back to him but was by any definition bullying. According to the Times, a senior MP said the speaker refused to be moved and added, he said that he's determined to keep buggering on and that he's got enough support across the Commons to do so. Mr. Burko is seen as more popular among the opposition benches in the Commons but believes he has good support to continue from both sides. Mr. Leakey added that it was difficult to remove Mr. Burko because Labour feel they benefit from his treatment of the Conservative front bench. In a statement before Newsnight, a spokesman for Mr. Burko said he and Mr. Leakey had previously had disagreements but denied allegations. The spokesman said, Mr. Speaker refutes all the allegations leveled by Mr. Leakey. John Burko and David Leakey are two very different people with very different backgrounds, perspectives and ideas. They had fundamental disagreements in 2011 and 2012 but interacted adequately after that. Mr. Leakey's accusations follow similar claims from former private secretaries Angus Sinclair and Kate Ems. An inquiry is already underway into claims of bullying by MPs, but the remit does not extend to historical cases. Theresa May finds the allegations concerning Downing Street is said and thinks they should be investigated.